Welcome back to the Michigan State Wells. Today we will be catching Indiana Ohio Railroad both of these days, February 3rd and the 24th of 2023 in February. However, this is a winter wonderland on an old DTNI. Our first train would only have Genesee and Wyoming engines, just orange and yellow type of engine. 34.89 is leading today. This turn comes from Delta, Ohio to Flatwood, Michigan. It does merge into the Canadian National at Flatwood, Michigan. Do a couple switching for like a few hours depending how much they had to do switching in flat lock yard. But however, he would do a lot of switching in flat lock. He would take forever. I don't mind if he takes forever. At least we've seen it. It's like like 4.42 p.m. So it's about to be dark. So this one we're seeing it now. We're back at Luga, Michigan. We've been waiting for the Indian Ohio Railroad once again. I think, and when I heard it this or this afternoon, it was gonna be like the same power. No, no, no! Not what I heard from my friend George. Thanks, George, for telling me what the power is. I was I was unexpected like this way. However, he would have a normal INO engine which is a Jeep 2101 with an R3L and an, an unexpectedly UP flagless triclop but the flag is not patched
these are all the trains that have been capturing on the old DTNI back in February. All of these are done back in February of 2023. However, I may get more INO soon on the old DTNI. Maybe with the autumn cutters. That would be kind of cool. But unfortunately, today's video will be an off here in Ruga, Michigan. Thank you for watching. I'll either see Senior, Michigan State, or Buckeye State Wells.